Welcome to our presentation about agriculture and construction machines. Today, we're in the assembly hall of SW near one of our BA722 machines. And I'll explain to you how you can use our system solutions for different components from the agriculture and construction industry. My name is Florian Schlotter, and I've been with SW since 2019. My colleagues from the technology department and I work together on individual customer questions for machining solutions for their client demands. For 25 years, SW projects have been a success after success in the agriculture and construction industries and have developed new machining processes in their own technology center. Of course, we always have your uses in mind. Forged materials and steel are often machined for the agriculture and construction industries. The priority is going to be robust and stable machines with capable spindles. Through quick tool changes following the pickup principle and the implementation of combination tools, we can reduce auxiliary times. Your output will be higher in the same amount of time. Thanks to our range of options, like the tool breakage monitoring system or the tool runout inspection, we reach a high level of process reliability. This means lower costs per part, allowing you to machine more effectively and productively. Smaller lot sizes and high model variety are no problem thanks to short changeover times. And despite heavy chipping and high mechanical demands, you can count on an SW machine to have a long lifetime. The typical work pieces in the agriculture and construction industries comprise the drivetrain, including cylinder heads, connecting rods, axle housings or brake calipers, and steering knuckles. As far as accessories, there are trailer hitches, hydraulic components, drawbar eyes, drill tips, chopping blades, holders for milling, or gear housings for rotary brakes. You can see, for example, the work pieces in front of me, a truck steering knuckle, a truck brake caliper, a gearbox for a rotary swathe, a strut from a truck steering system, and a truck connecting rod. And for every component, you can find the perfect solution in SW's portfolio of machines to accommodate the widest varieties of component size. The design principles for our machines are always the same. The heart of our machine is the monoblock. Through this, we achieve optimal force flow and very high machine stability. In combination with a powerful HSK-100 spindle, our machines are optimized for the heavy-duty field. Construction-wise, our machines are available with either one or two work tables. For the two-table machine with a double swivel carrier, we have the advantage of loading and unloading parallel to machining time. Many work pieces for the agriculture and construction branches require two tables. With the two-table machine with double swivel carrier, we have the ability to map both OPs in one machine. 63% lower energy costs, 33% less space needed, and 45% savings in cycle time per workpiece. These are the advantages of twin spindles compared to a single spindle. Alternatively, depending on the workpiece size, our machines can be equipped with four spindles. This allows the percentages I mentioned to be significantly increased again. Regardless of whether it's a machine with one or two work tables, there's the opportunity to equip the machine with a fifth axis. A machine with two tables can, of course, have one clamping bridge fixed with four axes and the other with five. This results in high investment cost savings because one or both clamping bridges could have a fifth axis and we will work with you to find the ideal solution for each component. As a standard, our BA7 is fitted with HSK 100 spindles with 400 Newton meters and 10,000 RPM. Alternatively, it's available with a strong spindle with up to 615 Newton meters. This spindle often has the advantage for heavy duty machining. The SW tool runout inspection is unique to the market. 
No other system can track tumbling of just 5 MU so precisely, especially right in the workshop. The relevant sensor is attached to a separate NC axis and can therefore be positioned at an early stage. This results in a reduction in your measurement time, thereby increasing your production and process reliability. If the machine is equipped with additional tool breakage monitoring, this sensor is attached to the same NC axis. Therefore, the tool breakage monitoring has no impact on cycle time. With the use of independent Z-axis, differences in tool length can be compensated for fairly easily. And even higher precision can be achieved through single spindle machining. This is necessary for a bearing set and a gear housing, for example. A 3D measuring probe for detecting measuring errors less than one micrometer is also available and can also balance the machine heat compensation. This measuring probe can also be used after each retooling of the first part. IO parts are processed immediately, thus reducing rejects and increasing the productivity of your machine. Now, we've learned about the machines. But a powerful machine alone is not enough if you want to manufacture economically. Clamping systems and fixtures are equally important. These are developed individually for each component with the SW internal fixture design. Tailored to your needs and our machines, thanks to our many years of experience in fixture construction, we can offer an economical solution for every component. And you, the customer, get everything from a single source. Of course, it's no problem if you already have such a device, or you would like to manufacture it yourself. You're welcome to provide this fixture. The advantages of a zero-point clamping system become especially clear with small series and a high level of variety. With a zero-point clamping system, it's relatively easy to precisely position and fix the fixture, the workpiece, and the clamping devices. This takes less than five minutes per table on an SW machine. In this way, a zero-point clamping system considerably reduces downtimes and setup times for a machine. This presents a huge advantage when it comes to saving process chain expenses. High cutting forces is no problem for zero-point systems. Our BA722, for example, has a clamping force of up to 80 kilonewtons. Your machine gains enormous flexibility with a zero-point clamping system. You can quickly process different workpieces one after another. Indeed, if you have more machines set up with a zero-point clamping system, it's fairly simple to get a workpiece from one machine to another and process it just as productively and quickly there. SW isn't stuck with just one specific zero-point clamping system manufacturer. So each customer requirement can be individually addressed. Our motto is, we think systems, and the system consists of more than just machining. Especially in the realm of heavy-duty machining, where heavy work pieces appear fairly often, the workers can't be expected to load a machine manually for eight hours a day. The right automation concept is important. And here, too, you can get everything from a single source from SW. Our top ROB or floor ROB loading modules are available for small production numbers. The 7 Series have standardized solutions in which either a robot is positioned on a pedestal or directly in front of the machine on the floor. In front of the robot is a buffer storage that works like a compact vertical ski lift that can be loaded and unloaded in parallel to machining time. If the clamping device is designated for several variants, there is also enormous flexibility here to be used in several different jobs. If the clamping device is equipped with a zero-point clamping system, it's also possible to store the devices temporarily in the buffer storage and relocate them depending on the purpose.
This creates a really high level of automation with a small footprint. For larger part quantities, we have the option to individually configure cells and process concepts according to production value to accommodate customer requirements while remaining modular and expandable. It's also possible to integrate the upstream or downstream processes into the production system, be it transportation of raw parts in the gantry, reading the DMC codes, or engraving after machining, labeling, or washing. Therefore, we always focus on a small footprint and free access to the machines. You want efficient processing, regardless of how big or small your work pieces are, or how high or low your production numbers are. We have the right product for your demands. Just get in touch. We look forward to working with you individually on your machining concepts. I hope that I stirred your interest with this presentation, and I would like to thank you for your attention. Thank you very much.